Hello y'all, how y'all doing today? Hope y'all are doing doing great. Back today with another video. Today I'm trying out another subscription box. I'm gonna try out shield box this time. See what we get in one of these. I've done a few battle boxes. I might switch it around. You know, I might do a few of these, might try a few different ones. So it's another one of them subscription boxes. This one doesn't have any any levels like the battle box does, but this one's more and it's more law enforcement kind of oriented or medical or so it's kind of kind of cool i've seen a few of these but i'm gonna give it a shot and see what we got might try a few of these again like i said maybe may do a battle box may do another few of these and a couple different ones i'll switch it around so i'm not doing the same thing over and over but anyway shield box. Let's see what they have to offer here. Let's see here. We've got some kind of paperwork in here. So that we don't spoil anything. Okay, so we got a little flyer product list. Looks like we've got a rechargeable flashlight. If I can find that rechargeable flashlight, let's sit here. Here we go. Rechargeable flashlight from Flat Eye. Never heard of that one before. Never heard of that brand. If you've heard of that, let me know in the comments what you think. If you've tried these or not. It's rechargeable LED. The unround light flashlight 250 lumens rechargeable six hours hmm well I might give it a try that's cool rechargeable flashlight maybe it can be in maybe it can be a nice little EDC light maybe we'll try maybe I don't know I've got a pretty good pretty good EDC light at the moment but we will maybe give that a check. And then it always comes with some fire starter. And that light is a, according to this, $35. Oh, like I said, I've never never heard of this brand. It does say waterproof, shockproof, pistol grip, high, low, medium, three function strobe, and a tactical polymer. So I don't know, I've never heard of the flat eye. Let me know if it's worth 35 bucks if you see it. I'll try and look up the products, leave links what I can find down below so that you guys have have the links if there's anything you want. And again, leave comments if you've heard of this. I've never heard of the flat eye brand. But we'll see. Okay. Next one is leather badge and ID holder this guy here is it this thing yep acre leather off duty I do like that made in USA that's nice So you can hang your badge. I'm not an officer, nor have I been, but put your badge in there, put your ID there, hang that around your neck. Cool. Well, like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm not in law enforcement, nor was I in law enforcement, but that's pretty cool. And that is a $25 is what they sell that for or say they sell they sell that for I will look and see what I can find on that I mean, it's pretty cool it's not something I'll use because like I said not law enforcement but maybe I'll put it for sale or give it to somebody if somebody wants to leave a comment or something if you're interested in it or put it in a giveaway or something 
and that's $25. And this box costed $50 for the box, plus shipping and taxes and all that. I think it came up to like 70 bucks. So if, according to that, we're basically, we're already almost to what I paid for it. And we're not even done. Okay, so we got dry fire trading cards. 17 bucks for trading cards. Not so sure about that, but... Dry fire trading cards. Should I open them up, take a look, see what we see what they look like? I don't know what these are. They might be. Oh yeah, see there's with a stool or a step directly to your left. Your right foot on the ground, put your left foot on the stool with your left knee bent. Huh, I call that lean and fire. Oh, these are dry fire. That's what I mean. dry fire playing cards, hey. They give you some, some little ideas how to. some shooting. For shooting, that's those are cool. A little dry fire shooting game. That's pretty cool. I might use those just for any, just for training purposes, for dry fire training purposes. That's pretty. Those are cool. Those are pretty, pretty slick. I like those. Those are. I might try using those, some of those into my dry fire training. Awesome. Those those. Those I definitely like. The flashlight's pretty cool. The wallet, it's nice, but not sure about me actually using it for anything. Okay, next one we've got a CLP gun oil, first line gun oil. Gun oiler. Where is that at? Is it this thing? Oh. It's this thing. This is the second one of these I've got. I've got one of these in... I think it was one of my battle boxes I got one of these in. But they're definitely coming handy. It's a little gun oiler. Now I've got a second one. Throw that in my range bag. Got a second one. Cool, cool. And they say that is twelve dollars. So we're already over the value of what I paid it at MSRP. But I'm sure we could find some of this stuff cheaper. And like I said, links for what I can find will be down below. But that's cool. I mean it's you can never have enough gun oil. That's good to have. Throw in your range bag or your bug out bag, your go bag, your whatever your range bag. And then we got Cobra Cuff Cobra Cuffs Some plastic Cobra Cuffs Oh hey those Those are kind of cool I mean they're not like Cuffs but they're They're like the zip tie type cuffs Take the little rubber band Off of them You put their arms in, you put their hand in there, and you just pull on that, and it and it kind of like cuffs them. Oh, you pull them right there, and it and it cuffs them, and then to release them, you you just pull out on these or in on those or let's see to release them pull out like that to release it let's see somehow you'll have to do this to release it but oh, okay okay I think you pull I think you do that to release them I don't know we'll have to check out how to release them but it, it, it has something to do with either push those or spread them or push them, or somehow you 
Oh, you do that. That locks them in. Or unlocks them. Hmm. Huh. We'll have to see how those work, but I think you pull that back out in order to release them. Cause see right there, they're locked in. You're not moving. Those are cool little cuffs. Definitely will come. Definitely could come in handy for. If I ever needed a kind of apprehend somebody and keep them keep them there, I'll figure out how those things work. But it has something to do with pull those back out or push them in or something or pull them out or whatever. But those are cool. I do think those are pretty cool, and those are four dollars. So, and that's the only. That's basically the last item. Total estimated value, $92.98. So you're basically... But they also have a freebie, some protein, plant protein. That's, that's a freebie. And then they've got... Let's see here. And they've got coupon codes for some things. And then, I think this is something I ordered extra. A Miranda card. Kind of a thick, heavy-duty card. But I kind of ordered that extra. It was a little bit. And then, $5 off your first box. You know, type of thing. So, that's cool. We got a freebie. Some plant protein. And then we got a few coupon code things it's for a book that's for a protocol protocol something dry fire training call that's for the dry fire training cards so pretty cool I mean that that's a pretty decent box I like the cuffs if I can ever figure out how to use them gun oil I can definitely use more gun oil the dry fire cards, those are those are cool. I will definitely use those in my dry fire training. Could even take them out to the range and use them in a in a real fire training. Just but those are cool. The badge holder, eh, it's cool. Don't get me wrong, I do like it, but it's just something I'm not I'm not in law enforcement, so it's something I would probably never use. And then the light. I will definitely check the light out and see. Maybe it's, it might, maybe it'll fit into the, into a rotation of my EDC, maybe, but we'll see. Maybe I'll do a full, full review on just the light. So stay tuned for that. So, yeah, that's it. Shield box. Doesn't quite have as much cool stuff as the battle box does, but it's, like I said, I only paid $50 for this box. And it also, like I said, is full of fire starter. There. So, and that's, that's really cool. But anyway, comment. Let me know what you think of Shield Box. If it's something you've tried or would willing to try. Or if you like any of the items. Let me know what, what you think. And comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And... Give me a thumbs up and hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video if, if you like what you see. And have a good night and I will see you next time.